<laughs> well, well, well. Look what we've got here. Yeah, <laughs> got here. <laughs> <laughs> Need some help, Henry? Yeah, help, Henry. <laughs> I'm asking the questions, Susan. Yeah, I'm asking the questions. Uh, oh, sorry, Margaret. Ha! What a snot slime you are, Henry. Can't even find your way out from under a blanket. Yeah, under a blanket. <laughs> what are you doing under there anyway, Beetle Bunts? Henrietta! Is that your seriously weird great old Greta? Yeah. Uh, I mean, no. She's not seriously weird. Time for a rock cake, Henrietta. She's seriously weird. Get lost, bogey brain. Oh, come on, Susan. Not worth wasting any more brain cells on this loser. Yeah, not worth wasting. Come on, Susan. We haven't got time for all that. Good riddance. Ah, that's where I put the sandwiches. <laughs> Want one, Henrietta? Oh, here goes. Um, <laughs> what's in these sandwiches? Sand, of course. That's why they're called sandwiches. Seriously weird. Do you like skipping, Henrietta? Oh, I used to love it when I was a girl. Um. Oh, come on, Henrietta. You can go faster than that. <laughs> faster! Faster! All oh, right, all oh, right. Sorry, God, stop. Oh, I'm turning the road for my seriously weird art. Oh. Them. <laughs> oh, you made me jump. <laughs> so, you think I'm seriously weird, do you? Well, are you? Come on, Henrietta, your turn. What? You made me jump all of that? Oh, yes. Don't you worry. I'll turn the rope very slowly. Well, OK, then. To start with. <laughs> oh, no. Bossy Bill. I can't let him see me skipping! Oh, look, Great Aunt Greta! Uh, pterodactyl! What was that? That was a pterodactyl. <laughs> a pterodactyl? You mad old lady. Oh, yes. It was definitely a pterodactyl. <laughs> Did you see it go? <laughs> Uh, um, come on, Bill. Uh, we've got an appointment with uh, your school headmaster. Phew! That was close. It's all right, Henrietta. You can come out now. Well, I can't say I blame you for trying to avoid that horrid boy. Let's see you jump, Henrietta. <sighs> That's my girl. Now let's try it a little bit faster, shall we? <sighs> this is actually quite fun. Whoa! <laughs> Isn't this fun, Henrietta? <laughs> Some homework. Ha, yeah, and how am I going to do that? Well, there are lots of 
websites that can help you with your homework. Well, is there one that actually does your homework for you? Well, what would be the point of that? Worth a look, Henry. Yeah. Well, thanks, Brian. Henry, Mum says... Go away, Worm. Can't you say I'm busy? Mum says she doesn't care it. What? She doesn't care that I'm doing homework? Henry? You're doing your homework? Yes. Look. The ultimate website for homework. Oh, Henry, you are doing your homework. Keep up the good work, Henry. It's all worth it in the end. Mum! Hmm, let's see. The ultimate website for homework excuses. <laughs> this is what I need. Let's try the random selector button. And what is your excuse this time? Well, I was halfway through my homework and I got distracted, Miss. Did you know? And what exactly was it that distracted you, Henry? An investigation into the root cause of physical randomicity, Miss. E eh? Yes, it's a really interesting subject. Would you uh, like me to tell you all about it, Miss? Uh, no, Henry, not now. But I'm glad to hear you've been doing some work, of sorts. So, Henry, anything distract you from your homework last night? Well, yes, Miss Battleaxe. I'm waiting, Henry. The fascinating question of whether man is mighty or mundane. Hmm, and what conclusion did you come to? Ah, uh, well, I didn't, Miss. You see... Oh. Oh. Don't tell me, Henry. You got distracted. Yes, miss. Interglycogenetics. Interglyco what? Interglycogenetics. Who can tell me what this means? Uh, Brian? Uh, an in-depth analysis of whether you really belong in your family or whether you are a changeling who has been left there as a punishment. Uh, nearly, Brian. Well, uh, I'm glad to see that someone else is keeping up with you, Henry. So, that will be your homework for tonight. I expect an essay on the subject of interglycogenetics <gasps> on my desk by the start of school tomorrow. <laughs> Class dismissed. Stop. I mean what I say, everyone. Triple detentions all round if anyone, and I mean anyone, fails to deliver. Oh, Henry, this is going to be so hard. <laughs> Game of football, Brian? No, I'm off to the library. Even I'm worried about this homework, Henry. Well, aren't you going to give me a hard time too, bogey brain? Huh? You talking to me, Snot Slime? Yeah. How much do you know about interglycogenetics? Quite a lot, actually. Huh? You mean, it's, it's really a subject? Yes. And it just so happens that my dad's best friend is the head of the Institute of Interglycogenetics. Really? Yeah, really. And it just so happens that he's coming to our house for dinner tonight. So I am sorted. Um, how about that game of football, Ralph? Uh, yeah. All right, then. Did I just imagine all that? I can see us very well. well. Of course they can't see us very well. There's a piece of paper in front of the camera. Why is there a piece of paper in front of the camera, Henry? Oh, it's called a special effect. It's supposed to make the video more interesting. Hmm. I see what you mean, Henry. Very interesting. Can't you think, Henry? <laughs> Shall we get on with the video? 
Pooper. Yes, me again. Take two. Ouch! Oh, one, two, three, four. What is it now, Ralph? Has this song got a name? Of course it's got a name. It's called The Song. The Song? That's what this song is called? Yeah, it's called The Song. Is that a problem? Well, it's not a proper name, is it? Of course it's a proper name. No, it's not. It's not a proper name like Thrash Hornets or Eggs on the Brain. Or Peas in a Pod. Yeah, Peas in a Pod. That's a great song. So is this. The song. A great song. Yeah, but it needs a proper name. It's got a proper name. It's called The Song. He's got a point. Mum says I can be in your video. Does she now? Yes. And she says if you say go away, smelly nappy baby, then she'll come in here and make everyone go away. And then there won't be any video at all. Really? Yes. So? You can be in my video. <laughs> smelly nappy baby. <laughs> <laughs> you can do the clapperboard. Oh! Mmm, goody! I'll do the best clapperboard ever, Henry. Really, I will. I know you will. Poopy pugs. Andrew, give the worm. I mean, give Peter the clapperboard. <laughs> no buts. The clapperboard, please. <laughs> Why does everyone want to be in my video? <laughs> Here, you can hold the special effect. The song. Take three. Action! <laughs> what do you want, bogey brain? You're making a music video, aren't you? No. Now go away, slug snot. Shut! Are you making a music video? I don't know. See? He said no. He said, I don't know, and that means yes. Well, I said no, and that means no. Ah! I don't believe you, Henry. If you're making a music video, then I want to be in it. I demand to be in it. <laughs> Where were we? The song. Take four. Action! Margaret's here, and she seems a little upset. So what? Don't be horrid, Henry. Henry, why are you playing in the dark? <laughs> yeah, Henry, why are you playing in the dark? Because we didn't want you to see us making a music video. Whoops. <coughs> Sorry, Henry. I'm going to be in your music video, whether you like it or not, Henry. <laughs> For heaven's sake! <laughs> Take this! Take mine! Oh, are you making a music video? Trying to! Can I be in it? <laughs> Fluffy Wuffy wants to be in the music video too, don't you, Fluffy Wuffy? I give up! You can all be in my music video! What do you have to say to that, Henry? Uh, yes, Miss Oppo. Right, well, it's early days. Now then, let's get on with the matter in hand, shall we? Yes, Miss Oppo. Take these. Yes, Miss Oppo. And report back to my office same time tomorrow morning. Yes, Miss Oppo. Well, off you go then. Yes, Miss Oppo. <laughs> What you doing? What does it look like I'm doing? Hello, my name is and I am an ambassador. Weird lines. 
That's enough! Now, he's got another page to do after this one. Thanks, Al. Oh, could you, Henry? Could I what? Steal what is rightfully mine! I don't know what you're talking about! That was my job! I was born to do it! Then go ahead and finish it! Oh, I'm not playing your little game anymore, Henry. Boys, you're making the noise. Uh, Henri le Hurid. Yes, Madame Tutu? What are you doing, Henri le Hurid? I'm doing my lines, Madame Tutu. <laughs> and we're watching him, Madame Tutu. I think, little boys, that perhaps you would be happier on the story carpet. <laughs> Search me. Greetings, Lord High Majesty and Ambassador. Oh, don't you stop, Brian. Maybe you'd like to do my lines for me. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> so funny. You! You thought these were your lines. And? You don't know, do you? No, what? That you're an ambassador. Am I? That's what it says here. Look! There's a specs for your name. My name's Henry and I'm an ambassador. I'm an ambassador! Ambassador Henry! Cool! <coughs> um, is it cool? It's very cool. That's why Peter was so upset. He wants to be an ambassador. Ambassador, a high-ranking official who represents his or her country. But Henry doesn't have a country. Doesn't matter. Oh, I'm an ambassador. Come on then, Ambassador Henry. Let's go and tell the others. Can you your lines, Henry Le Hurry? Don't have to, Madam Tutu. Oh, I'm an ambassador. C'est à l'heure, you boys. Watch it, Beetlebugs. Watch it, ambassador, I think you mean. Side Tiddlywinks team. Ooh, that sounds exciting. Morning, Henry. Mm. Oh, yeah, it is very exciting. Almost as exciting as being leader of the Free World Society. And what's that when it's at home? Don't be horrid, Henry. Woo, woo, we're having elections at our school. Are you now? Yes, we are, and I'm really hoping that they'll pick me. Sweetie, if it's an election, they'll be voting for you. It takes courage, confidence and nerves of steel to be a winner, Peter. And a good as gold book that's full of good as gold stars. <laughs> that's not how it works, Peter. OK, y'all, so at my school we get a head start if your parents are very, very rich. Or if you've got three houses, one of which is a castle. Well, how is that fair? Oh, it's not. <sighs> Come on, everyone. It's time for school. Look at him. He thinks he's so smart. Well, he's got an audience. 
So that was my fifth successful election. Or was it my sixth? Well, that's six times too many. Hey, Henry, wait up. I'm standing for election. <laughs> for what? The World Jelly Baby Council? No, your school council. Wait, you're standing for our school council? Oh, yeah. I've had a word with Miss Battleax and there's nothing in the rules to stop me. But it's our school council. You don't even go to this school. Well, I do for today, and apparently that's enough. Right, that's it. I'm standing for election. If you're standing, then I'll be your campaign manager. Yeah, your campaign manager. Managers. Thank you, I think. So, would our two candidates like to tell us what they can promise when, or rather, if they're elected? Certainly, Miss B, if I may call you that. <laughs> <laughs> My message is a simple one. You can say that again. I promise to make Ashton great again. You what? When was Ashton ever great? Don't be horrid, Henry. I mean, I know it's our home and the football team's not bad and it's got a whopper whoopee and the park's pretty cool, but it's not great. Exactly, Henry. So I'm going to make it great again. What am I going to say? I'm sure you'll come up with something. Yeah, come up with something. Thanks. Um, well, my mission is very simple, too. <clears throat> if I'm elected, I promise... No more detention, no more homework, and chocolate milkshakes for everyone! 